Chris, uh, once again, a poor start has cost you today. Yeah, um, obviously we didn't go off to the best of starts and, you know, I think 30 minutes gone, we're 4-0 down, um, which gives no team a chance to, to win a game. Um, even the top teams would struggle to do that. Uh, so, you know, we went at half-time and we had a, a few words said, um, rightly so. And we came out the second half obviously fighting and we won the second half, which is probably the only positive of, of the game. It seems to be the case at home that you start brightly and then give yourselves too much to do in the second half. Is it hard to pinpoint a reason for that? Um, I just think everybody has to be standard and counted for. I think we have to start doing the basics better um, and, and, and look at it and analyse it, whoever it is, and, and see what happens. But we have to stick together. Um, in a football game, I think you have to do the basics right before you win, um, and we're just not doing that at this moment in time. We're giving ourselves a mountain to climb each game. Um, so, as I said, the, the most positive thing out of this game is that we won the second half, and probably the most positive as well is that we can score goals, and, and I think hopefully that will that will get us out of this situation. Does that add to the frustration, though, because seeing how you can play and then not doing it for a full 90 minutes where you would pick up more points? I think it's, that's the problem. We need to start doing it for the full 90 minutes. We need to be switched on, we need to be organised, we need to be concentration levels for the 90, 90, 95 minutes. And we're just not doing that at this moment in time. Um, us as players have to make sure that we, we rise to that and, and, and step over on that pitch and make sure that we, we do everything possible for the 90 plus minutes to win the football match, not just 45. And there's no real time to dwell on it at this stage of the season. It's just about getting enough points to keep your heads above water. Yeah, well, the the good thing is, is it's in our hands, isn't it? Um, we've got another game here at home. Um, so we've got our two home games, which is great for us. Um, I thought the fans were fantastic. They got behind us and they, they came here. And hopefully they can do the same again on Saturday for us because it will help. Um, but I'm sure and I'm positive as, as well as the players in the dressing room and the staff and the manager that we will win on Saturday.